what's the difference between security and data governance? Um, security is a fundamental part of data governance, uh, but it's just one part, right? So it's very critical to clearly define who has access to the data and ensure that um, only the right people can access, you know, personally identifiable data. But data governance is so much more, right? So there are legal requirements, for example, in banking that define uh, that you need to document how did you get to an analytical result? How did you calculate a risk score? And you need to show these are the you know, 45 steps that the data went through before we get to this risk score to document that you didn't discriminate anybody, um, that it's reproducible, you know, that it's really kind of a, a legally solid calculation result how we got to a risk score. And that's just one example, this data lineage example. There's so much more in data governance. And what is really interesting is if you think about security, security is all around locking data down. And what's interesting about data governance is all about really empowering more people to access and analyze the data, but in a controlled environment that you can really, um, you know, reproduce what happened, you know, where you have change logs, where you have data lineage, where you can clearly define. And what's um, really exciting for me is, as we're trying to democratize data access, data governance is a really fundamental step in the right direction to actually make democratization possible. If you think of a society, right, we can't just say, hey, everybody decides everything. We need, we need rules, we need a framework, a framework of engagement, how we build a society. And this is kind of the cool thing about data governance. It's really like governance in a state, in a society, allowing kind of a more holistic approach to democratizing access to the data, and then really um, making sure that only the right things happen to the data. What is critical today as we're tracking more and more personally identifiable data, healthcare data, or we're calculating really you know, predictive risk when someone gets a home loan or a credit uh, from a bank. We want to make sure that is a controlled um, process and, um, you know, it's, it's fair to everybody. That's why data governance is a critical piece to a f um, larger deployment um, of big data technology in enterprises. And it's critical to get more people access in a controlled environment to that data.